because it's actually a game about Baby a very mode. short person. <laughs> <Look at him. laughs> what? Come get some Baby hyperviolence, <laughs> Bane Moraine, and masochism, beloved. Oh boy. Let me see Baby Mode. I missed it. it it's this. Oh. It's like the Wolfenstein difficulty select. Uh, His baby mode face makes me think women would flock to him. Hyperviolence hyper is probably the normal mode. Uh, ready for hyperviolence? The, the, the menu music did not come back. And then the music comes at you at full blast. Armored Core had another patch update. Oh. Uh, I don't know what they changed. Kinda of like the drawn gun model. Yeah. Uh, looks like there's no inverted aim option in this demo. Ah, uh, it's too bad. I realize it's probably not a priority in an early build, but it's always a bummer when they don't have it. Yeah. Just aim backwards. Easy. Obviously. Very obviously. <laughs> not all that obvious. Storm the hell, the health are fucking see. cans of monster, basically. Are these like the, the Smash Brothers, like, uh, like, S dummy? That you knock really far? Oh, you're a ghost. Yeah, sandbag. It's a ghost. I heard a gun. Let's see the gun. Does your gun have devil horns, really? It kind of does. It's an evil gun. Evil. Poop. Right click to punch shit. Punch shit. Shooting enemies builds fervor. I need bathroom. Fervor equals punch damage. Fervor resets post punch. Oh, now this is a boomstick. to wake up Dane. I guess it is. The visuals kind of remind me of a project I've sent you. Cut the Kill presents. It's got those Euro plugs. Oh god, what the what the fuck happened? Oh, oh Jesus. Um a new dial tone. Call Alyssa. Call Alyssa. Dane, are you okay? Where are you? Where are you? What is going on? I mean, what, what are these creatures? I don't know. Something's gone wrong. Just focus on getting out of there and we can meet up later, okay? Wait, but where are you? Don't worry about me. Just get to the evac. Ugh, great. Incoming call from Zen. Yes, answer call. Oh, finally, someone from HQ. What the hell? 
hell's going on? Man, I was going to ask you the same thing. Fuck! All we know is there's been a collision with some foreign entity. And all of our systems have been fucked! Then what's the deal with the zombie creature? I don't know. Obliterated that man. Yeah. Just gave him the old. Yep. This pistol's a real pop gun. We got here. And it does have a big old suppressor on that front end. Is that what that is? At least it, it looks like it. Yeah, like one of those square ones. Oh, uh, yeah. He just fucking say Gadzooks. I'm pretty sure he did, yeah. Gadzooks. <laughs> I need a, a Gadzooks on my soundboard now. <laughs> Let me guess, this one probably doesn't have a map either, right? Or even an in-game menu, in this case. Oh, there's a demo. Yeah. I'm betting Bears in Space didn't have a map either. What's with all the friggin' key cards? Goddamn key cards. These killer key cards suck. Looks like this one still needs a couple layers of polish. Uh, a couple. Do you like the little ding when you headshot though? <laughs> oh, no, it's for a weak point. That's. Yeah. Okay. That makes sense. I like when games do that. Like good feedback. Hmm. I feel like the crosshair could be just a little bit small. Yeah, you're probably right. I mean, it's not like you're having trouble or anything. No. I feel like the brightness could be turned up a bit too. But that's pretty much every game in my experience. Please adjust until the image on the right is barely visible. Yeah, no. Cranks it to max. Remember that time I was visible? Yep. 
That has happened before. Quite a few times, Let if I remember in. correctly. Let me in. That happened once. Let me in. I like how pissy he is about locked doors. I like how he's like kind of whiny. Yeah. <laughs> that like he could have been cool shooter man just from the voice, but like. He's one. Yeah, what is with these ones? A couple of Tarzans. No, it's just like I have a really hard time hitting them for some reason. There's a shotgun in there. Double chainsaw. <laughs> nice. Yeah, uh, sound the sounds definitely need a pass. Yeah. Oh, maybe I can get to that elf back there now. Guess not. Mm, guess not. Yeah, it's like the Doom 64 chainsaw. Does it not use ammo? No, it's like the Doom chainsaw. That's excellent. And I mean like the actual Doom chainsaw, not the not the 2016 and eternal one. Yeah. You gotta guzzle gasoline. Trade-off being, if you have enough fuel, you can insta-kill any one enemy, including the really annoying ones. This kind of works better than the pistol. I mean, I would hope so. Yeah, melee weapons in a shooter should always be a risk-reward thing. Or like, you know, your last chance back up like with the fist. So, uh, you know, I'd hope the chainsaw is good. Huh. Yes, good. Concept. What's your concept? Uh, this would totally be stupid and impractical, but as a weapon in an FPS, it'd be great. Four-bladed chainsaw. That's rotary like a minigun. <laughs> Just the fucking the drill saw. Absolutely stupid, but really cool. I want to see it. Oh, I actually scratched that. That's a, an upgrade to the minigun. It just gets like chainsaw blades on the outside, so it has increased like damage up close, basically. That would be great. I feel like I've seen something like this somewhere. Like a minigun with a specific close range damage boost. Uh, the you can do that in Deep Rock, one of the overclocks. Oh yeah, the one where it burns enemies up close. 
Yeah, and uh, technically the Hulong heater, or at least how it used to work in uh, TF2. They changed it and now it sucks. Uh, like, actually. Yeah. But no, it. Listen. If I say the words chainsaw minigun to you and you don't say fuck yeah, I don't want to talk to you. Oh, sorry, I didn't say fuck yeah. But, you know, like. Metaphorically. <laughs> you don't have to literally say those words, but, like. I mean, if you don't immediately agree with that concept. Oh. I have a problem. I reached the end of the level, I guess. Uh, bonus points of the body of the chainsaw minigun just looks like a diesel engine. Yeah. Heavy machinery. There's the damn shotgun. Oh, now this is a boomstick. What the fuck? It's a friend, but like in reverse. This room could use a spot of red. Shotgun animation definitely needs uh, a little more oomph. Yeah, it definitely needs a pass on visual feedback. But it works. Which I guess is the important part. Yeah, the gameplay seems totally fine. It helps that it's, you know, it's doom. More or less. Just a little, yeah. lo like, looser. Pyzone, I like the way you think. What if the rockets are rocker propelled chainsaws? <laughs> I appreciate the generous amount of health pickups. Yeah. I guess it'd be worse if I was on like Bain Moraine difficulty or whatever. Or masochism, my friend. say uh two is better than one and then like sometimes under his breath i think he did yeah this crosshair definitely needs to be smaller i can't see what the fuck i'm shooting at yeah but this is the i can't see shit and it don't matter weapon Shares ammo with the the starting pistol. It's a mess. That was a pretty good line. Yeah, I I think the crosshair is set up so it's like. You kind of know that it's aiming to the sides a little. Like it's not centered. Is it? Oh yeah, you're right. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. I can see that from the shots. So like, it, it's sensible. It just needs to be a little, little cleaner. Also, funny having a, a gun like this that has projectiles and isn't hit scan. Yeah. It's kind of neat.
It's like a lost soul with more health. I lost sauce. Don't lose the sauce. I'm trying. All right, the shotgun and the dualies are pretty nice. Definitely an improvement over the pistol. Also, I think that enemy just shot through the closed door. That needs a that needs looking at. Yeah. There's one earlier that like walked through a closed door. Oh no. What happened? I punched a barrel and I died. Uh, I gotta start the level over. Ouch. Had to happen sometime, I guess. Now this is a boomstick. Always happens to me. Wow. Well. That noise sounded like he was opening cracking open a cold one. He was. The health pick oh. the health pickups are fucking energy tricks. They look like monsters. <gasps> He's literally cracking open a cold one. It's the Malcolm game. Wait, what? What? What's up, car? Nothing. Malcolm pointed out a game is burned to Pal World, guys. Yeah, he was trying to show me something, but I was like, I'm going to Pal World, guys. I guess it is. Wow. They used to be the Craftopia guys, now they're the dog. Whatever. Looks fun though. It looks like Hollow Knight with a co op. Yeah, it looks okay. Is that got a demo in the fest? 
It does actually. I'll put it in video games. I don't know if the demo is multiplayer right now. Never a grave. Let me see what the discussion is here. Reserve your power. Oh shit. One moment, there was a phone call. I'm enjoying this oh, one so it's far. A different developer. Nevergrave has a different developer, is all. Oh, okay. It's published by Pocket Bear. Well, that reminds me. I, I I'm waiting. I'm waiting on a game that's coming called uh, Pro Sworn. It's kind of like a Hollow Knight. Like, I was a. Uh, that could fill a niche. Yeah, I, I backed it on Kickstarter. I'm not sure when it's coming out. I could check uh, when I get a second. Today. Today. I'm just saying today to make you panic. If it was out, I guess I would stream that. Uh, after I ran out of demos, I guess. He's trying his best with the way he liners. Yeah. <laughs> There's a mecha farming sim called Light Your Frontier on Demo Fest. Yeah, that was like the first result. Is that enough? Hold on. Three rivals as a demo. Oh. Yeah, I have it. I guess I'm gonna give it a try. Shazbot. Yeah, Shazbot. Yeah, Shaves butt. Uh, I mean, I guess. What kind of speeds will we go now with the new engine? Is it a new engine? Because it really just looks like they're rehashing a scent. Probably. Except so. Yeah, it's it's totally still high res, even if it doesn't say that on the fucking thing. Prophecy games, prophecy games. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's like a subdivision of high res. Yeah, that definitely hurts. It's weird. There's like a tiny little bit of wobble to your view in this. Boom, 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 boom. 
realm of ink looks kind of like a Hades, like an action realm like like Hades. And called a limb. Called to the lamb is an action roguelike. It is. Is it? I, I don't know anything about. It. Ah, won't budge. <laughs> yep, action roguelike. You ever played Hades Chaos? I tried it. It was an epic exclusive, so I didn't yeah, buy it. Oh, is it really? I see it on Steam. That's because it came to Steam a, a year later. Uh. I'm not sure how to progress. Oh. I see the character for Echo Point Nova on the demo fest list, and it looks like Gabriel from Ultra Kill. Yeah, that's from the developer of uh, Severed Steel, which was a very good game. Sneaky. Hashtag blood. Yeah, I have a demo for that. It's a top-down action game. Yeah, with a like goofy it. sort of Dexter's Lab-ish art style. In tight. Oh, thank you. It is. Oh shit, really? It's a key item? Yep. Whoa. Because it's because it's a key. A ship like Doom Keys too. Out. Another level. <laughs> Apparently there was like wolf or dog people in this. Man, help me keep watch. We need all the help. They're getting ready to defend the lilac system. Uh, I'm not too good at shooting. <laughs> You've got a gun license, and that's all that matters. Take your pick from the armory and get to a post. Oh, hi, hi, officer. What do we got? A lever action? Ah, the old familiar. Right. Well, I use this again. <laughs> uh oh. Holy fucking shit! Cat soup. Oh no. Okay, the crosshair for this one actually is a blinking high. Ouch. Also, everyone but me is dead. There's uh, this thing that Capcom put out. I, I don't know what they're exactly planning on with it, but it's like a 
that all you got? They, they present a bunch of questions and you answer them about like what you like from Capcom games. Like, well, what's your favorite game? What's your favorite character? That kind of thing. Yeah. I, I out of curiosity, I, I typed in for like Dante, and y you have a choice. Please, please look in clap chat. All right, fine. Oh. <laughs> I see. Who's, Who's gonna pick that as their favorite character? Who? Who? Why is he here? Good on them for remembering he's a different character. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna play that one too when I play through Devil May Cry. Well, I, I mean, I had to play Chain of Memory, so... Exactly. Exactly. Plus, uh, you know, Dick Move Capcom isn't actually that bad a game. It's just... very questionably written. It's just absolutely not Devil May Cry. Absolutely not. Oh, I've been raided. Oh, shit. Well, we're the party of six people. Oh, what's what's up, Ratio? Yeah, hey, it's the guy. Is the sound of this thing cycling the Garan the Garan noise, Malkin? But like sped up a little. Uh, yeah, basically. Yeah. Act one complete. Yeah. First time chat from Raider, Jeff the Hobo. We were ordered to behave and not make inappropriate comments. What? Who told you that? You need to get inappropriate up in here. And thought everyone should see the jiggle. That's true. It's true. I, I keep forgetting my avatar is very uh, bouncy. I don't know. That would look nice. I said behave, not about the other one. <laughs> uh, thank you for the raid, Ratchel. I appreciate it. I usually forget to do that. Either that or you end the stream so late that no one else is on. Yeah, or that. Looks like... Broadcast array, non-functional. Damn it! I guess I'm talking to the others through terminals now. We're uh, playing a bunch of demos today for the next fest. Yeah. Right now it's uh, what was the name of it? Bane Moraine. Hello, is that? Oh, is this thing working? It's just a codec call. Dane? Why the fuck? Still on the ship? Dropship exploded. What? What about all the scientists? The, the civilians? I I don't want to talk about it. Are you okay? I, uh, how how are you getting out of there? Well, I was gonna ask you the same thing, actually. Ah, shoot. Right, yeah, I, I guess I am the guy behind the chair here. Uh... Where's that chair magic, my friend? How do I get off this hunk of junk? Okay, uh, let's see here. Good news is there's another escape pod bay. Uh, relatively close. Yeah, this one's a little rough around the edges. Uh, they kind of all have been. Except Mullet Mad Jack. That was super slick. Oh, uh, that last one was pretty cool, actually. Uh, uh Bears, Bears in space. space? Yeah, that one was a little better, but like... Caesar's Revenge, uh, this... Flaw, especially. All, all very early and rough. news is it's headed in the direction that our uninvited guests are coming from. The, the top of the ship. Ah, oh, fuck. Uh, I don't suppose that's also the collision point of that unknown space object. You're a good guesser. Well, you're a good listener. Yeah? Well, it's, it's kind of 
part of the job description. <laughs> you keep doing what you're doing, and I'll head to the escape pods. Yeah, yeah, okay. Uh, keep me updated. I'll try my best. If not, I'll see you back on Earth. Oh, I didn't get to call the other person. All right. Weapon upgrades here. Ooh. Next shotgun upgrade gives it another barrel. Oh, yeah. I want that. I don't have enough essence, though. Is that what those are? Oh, uh, that, that is what those are. Those blue orbs. I was wondering about that. Oh, oh. Ratchel says the terminal said it only had enough power for one call. I missed that. Whoops. I... Uh, what the... It's locked? Oh, well, that wasn't part of the script. I guess this is the end of the demo, then. Well, that's a bit anticlimactic. I was just getting interested. What? Darn. That's funny, though. I like how it's really, like, scribbled on there. It doesn't even end. I'm just stuck here. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh... That was, uh, Bane Moraine. I like this one. <laughs>